Hey YouTube, what's up? <laughs> 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 oh, oh. Go on, okay. Go on. Ready? Go. Hey YouTube, what is you shall we? I'm Kate, I'm Anime. And you're watching Chicane TV. Hey guys, so we wanted to quickly talk about this whole Maya Jamai situation. Obviously, Maya Jamai is now the new host of Love Island. Um, and her first season is this season, season nine, Winter Love Island. So, you know, obviously, we, you know, we, we get like comments here and there on our videos, basically talking about stuff that's happening with Maya Jama. I think people have been bringing up, basically Maya Jama had a bit of a scandal a few years ago while she was dating Stormzy. And um, the scandal was basically somebody unearthed tweets of her. I think, I think my jam is biracial. I think she's half. Is Somali? I think it is. Mm. I think it's either S Somali yeah. or Etrian, one of them. Oh. It's it's some kind of. I'll find out. Somali. Somali. Okay. So she's half Somali and she's and she's. I think she's half. She's half white. So um. Anyway, somebody on somebody found tweets of her basically making colorist tweets about black women, and it was a it was a huge scandal. And um, I think that from there, it, that was kind of like where, you know, she kind of lost good graces with, with the black community because I think she was quite popular anyway because she was dating Stormzy and then when mm. these tweets unearthed, so like it took her a while to kind of, for people to stop mentioning it. But obviously now she's hosting Love Island. They've resurfaced. They've resurfaced. <laughs> so, you know, I, I, so one of the comments that somebody left on our video was around basically saying that, how can black women be supporting my Jama mm. after her tweets? And for me, I, I feel like when a scandal like that happens, I feel like every everybody deserves an opportunity to redeem themselves. That's how I feel. I feel like if it happens again, like if, it, if it's something that keeps on happening, then I feel like it's a different conversation. But I do feel like it's important to allow people to grow. Mm. What, what do you think? No, I actually agree. I actually agree with it. I mean, do we know, like, how, how old was she when she tweeted those things? Because uh, that's another thing. If they, if she was a fully grown adult, then... I think she was. I think she was. I think it was like late teens or something. Like it wasn't oh. late teens, early 20s. Like it wasn't... I mean, I guess you can still be immature. But yeah. Yeah, I mean, oh, I don't know, you know. I don't even remember what, what kind of stuff she was... Same. I'd have to find it. I'd have to find it, but it was like color. It was like proper like colorist mm. stuff. Do you know what I mean? I but do. I mean, I do think everyone should have a chance to redeem themselves and yeah. to make up for it. I don't know if she has, because did she ever apologize? I have to find it. I, mm. I, I, I think she did. I think she addressed it, but I don't think. I think she was dating Stormzy at the time, and I don't think Stormzy addressed it. Mm. But, but I do okay. remember. I do remember some kind of um, statement. Mm. You know. <laughs> You know, like I said, I feel like it's important to allow people grace and allow people the the, the chance to grow. Mm. You know, and you know, obviously we're watching, isn't it? Like, like, like we're we're watching the play and we're seeing, you know, how things pan out. You know, and mm. so far I haven't, you know, I, I I think, you know, her hands are clean. So let's let's see how things go, innit? Yeah, exactly. And then I think another another sto another reason why she was trending as well is that she was engaged to I think he's an American basketballer yeah and I think apparently he gave her a ring that was nearly nine hundred thousand mm -hmm. dollars like a really expensive ring so <clears throat> word 
on the street is that like, the engagement is over and he's, he's looking for his ring. He wants his <coughs> ring back. That's, that's, that's the latest scandal. So I think she kind of posted like a sub on her page, basically saying that it's not true. She didn't, oh, say, it? She didn't say it directly, but it was kind of like she posted a meme basically indicating that it's not true. Oh. Which part of it that is not true, we don't know. Is it that your engagement is off or is it that he doesn't want his ring back? Like, which part of it is, is not true? Like, mm. she wasn't specific. So, so what do you think about that? Do you think that... Because there were quite a few people in the comments basically saying that how an engagement ring is a gift. So why would he want it back? Yeah. Like, like what, what do you think? I, d- I don't think he should ask for it back, personally. Like, if, I, if I was engaged to someone and they, we broke off the engagement and he asked for the ring back, I wouldn't give it to him back. I wouldn't give it back. I don't know. I don't think... Well, like, why? Would you give him a ring back? It would be, it, it, I don't know, I mean, it would be interesting to know what the law says. Because like, he sent her a legal letter, apparently. Yeah. <laughs> it would be interesting to know what the law says, because, because because the thing with an engagement ring is that an engagement ring, my understanding of an engagement ring is an engagement to marriage. Yeah. So it's not just, it's not like a promise ring where that's a gift. It's not like just, a, oh, here's some jewellery or whatever. It's, it's basically somebody giving you something with the intention. It's almost like them paying a deposit for you. It's, it's like similar to a dowry. Sim- not well, not similar, but it's, it's, there's, there's an intention behind that gift. Mm. It's not just, it's not just giving you the ring. So legally, because they didn't, you know, the marriage was canceled, maybe he does have a legal right to have the ring back because the basis of him giving you the ring no longer stands. I mean, because what if, okay, like a circumstance, say if he gets you the ring mm. and you've you've been engaged for like five years, yeah. that you've been pressuring him, we, when, we need to set a date, we need to set a date, yeah. and then it gets broken off after five years, you will still give the ring back? First of all, first of all, I wouldn't be engaged. But that's what I'm you. saying. If that was, no, I mean, this is just a like, second. We're, we're getting engaged, we need to be I ready. answer that question. Um. Obviously, I, I, you're going to be dragging out a yeah, engagement for yeah, 10 absolutely. years. Listen, any, anyone that's watching us, that, if, if a man gives you a ring, he needs to be marrying you within a year. Even if you guys do registry while you plan for your big day, don't allow anybody to, to allow you to be an, an, an engaged, a, a fiancé for, a, a fiance for five years. Don't allow, anybody to, yeah, don't allow anyone to agree. do that to you. I agree. Well, where's but your time? If, it was, if that was the situation. Yeah. Five years you've been saying, look, we need to set a date, we need to set a date, and then, oh, you end up breaking it off. Would you give him the ring back? Then? Let me be honest with you. If you wanted his ring back, more for me. More for me. Hmm? More for me. If you wanted his ring back, more for me. I'm sorry, that that's, 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 that's the, 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 the principle still stands, in it? So you were giving the ring back? I'm just... You yeah, yeah, answered the question. <laughs> you actually haven't answered. I would not. That's what I'm saying. The problem, the, the, see, so the so problem is, I, I can't imagine. Yeah, obviously, I, obviously, in that scenario, God forbid that ever happened, I would make him. You know, I would take me to court. Yeah. Because you wasted my, you wasted my time. <laughs> take me to court. You're taking a fucking piss. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? But I feel like no woman should allow herself to be a forever fiance. That yeah. to me, that's 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 just embarrassing. Like it's a, it's a waste of your time. Mm-hmm. Do you know what I mean? But um, but yeah, I mean. I don't know. I mean, I, I guess it also depends on why the, the engagement was broken off as well. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Like, if he cheated on her, I don't blame her for not wanting to give the ring back. There's a lot of factors. We yeah. need to know the details because either way, I wouldn't give the ring back anyway, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> but yeah, I'd like to know a bit more because if she's saying it's false anyway, well, I guess we'll never know. She's saying it's not real. Yeah, but she hasn't said which part is false though. Mm. Do you know what I mean? Like, it might be that they're still engaged. So, um... That it. But anyway, guys, let, let us know what you think about this whole engagement thing. Um, it's an interesting thing because the thing is, a part of me is feels like maybe I would give the ring back mm. because if our engagement is over, I don't want it. I don't want any ties to you. Do you it's, know what I mean? He's pulling it. Buy a house with that. Yeah, I wouldn't give it back. Just so you know, I'll invest the money in a couple of businesses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll buy a car. <laughs> Even though I can't drive. Yeah. No, I ain't getting you ain't getting that ring back. That's all you need to know. Yeah. Anyway, guys, let us know what you think about this. Um, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Comment and subscribe. And hit the notification button. Because if you miss it, you, you miss it. Toodles. Oh, wow.
original. Mm-hmm.